Now we have all understood that the reason for IVF failure could be predominantly the embryogenetics. Now when we have been doing PGTA for the last few years and we have had patients who are conceiving and some who are not conceiving and we, when we go back and look at our data, so we have realized that the most important reason for chromosome aneuploidy or abnormal embryos is the advancing female age. Now why is it so? Because as the female age is increasing, there are issues with the oocyte quality. So here there are changes within the egg that is happening which leads to chromosomal mutations and that can lead to increasing number of abnormal embryos. So when we go back and look at our data and our success rate, younger patients with are having higher number of chromosomally normal embryos and having higher success rates whereas the older women, especially women who are crossing 37 years are needing more number of IVF cycles to create these normal embryos and achieve the same success rate. Communicate to all the patients trying for pregnancy is plan when the female age is younger and the oocyte quality is better to have higher pregnancy rates. Thank you.